An embrastic government has commenced the process of converting diesel-powered street lights to solar to boost power supply in the state. The Commissioner for Power and Water Resources, Engineer Julius Chukwemeka, disclosed this during bilateral discussion between the Anambra State House of Assembly Committee on Public Utilities and Ministry of Power on the 2023 budget estimate for the ministry held at the Legislative Complex in Oka. House of Assembly correspondent Chukwemeka Modelim filed the report taken from here. According to Engineer Chukwemeka, the initiative will enable Anambra state government to save huge revenue for the state, save Anambra from environmental hazards and improve on the state security. Anambra State Commissioner emphasized that in 2023, the Soludo administration will extend power to many areas and install transformers at places where they are needed to stabilize power in the state. He also mentioned public institutions like schools, hospitals, public offices, markets, among others, as areas where Anambra state government will extend water and carry out integrated power supply, adding that the project is in line with the vision of Governor Chukuma Soludo of ensuring that Anambra state has a good education system that will produce students who are marketable. In his remarks, the chairman of Anambra State House of Assembly Committee on Public Utilities, Engineer Imawafo, observed that Governor Soludo is committed to revamping many water schemes in the state so that India Anambra will enjoy pipe water in 2023. Engineer Imawafo also installed plan by the state government to procure more five trucks next year by quick response to fire outbreaks, assuring that the committee will partner him to realize his vision for the power sector. 